us now. Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Stardew Valley. It is Saturday, the sixth day of fall. Let's see. I have plans for today, but let's see what the weather is like tomorrow. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. All right, that's fine. But more importantly, fortune teller, come on, give us a lucky day because yes, yes. That is the day I want because today, my friends, is a special day. We are going hunting for a legendary fish. That's right, one of the rarest of the rares. The hard to find, we are looking for the anglerfish. Stick with me, this is going to be a great day. Oh, we have mail. What is our mail today? Hey, I thought it would be fun to send you a letter. I don't really know what to write though. Here, I've enclosed a treat for you. Don't tell anyone, but I snagged this from the back room of Jojo Mart ages ago. See you soon, Shane. And he sent me Pepper Poppers. Oh, thank you, Shane. That is so sweet and so hilarious. Bless your heart. You know what I'm going to do with it? I'm going to put it in the gifting. Oh my gosh. 130 energy, plus 58 health, plus two farming, plus one speed. That is fantastic. But the reason I'm putting it in the gifting box is that Shane absolutely loves pepper poppers. So I'm going to actually hang on to it for him. Oh, how wonderful. That is great. What a fantastic start to the day. We've got some crops. Don't get distracted, Pen. We've got some crops, but first off, we're going to go in and see our happy, happy little chickens. Yes, we are. Hello, darlings. And don't forget to let them out. Good, good. So we need to water our farm. We need to go and see Robin uh, and start our barn because we have 8,200 gold. Sorry, that was, I was trying to think and walk at the same time. And as you can see, that was a real struggle. <laughs> Never mind. Okay. I need my wheat seeds because we have to harvest ourselves some wheat. And you know what else you need? You need a side pen. Good, good. Very good. All right. We're with it. We're with it today. We've got our wheat. That is fantastic. And we'll fill in all those empty. Our goal this season is to keep this farm absolutely 100% chockers with stuff so that we get lots and lots of money. That is great. Look at that. Nothing else to harvest? No. Okay, let's go and sell some of this and get on with our watering. The problem with putting fertilizer on everything is that you don't often get um, crops that aren't gold and silver star. And of course, you know, you want to sell them for money. Um, but I do need to keep some for cooking because I'm going to get a kitchen in winter, I hope. So I'll just have to make sure that I keep some for the end of season. You don't need many for cooking, you know, because you some of the recipes that you cook, you just want to cook once. You know, you just want to cook them to get your um, achievement, your collection achievement, this one. Um, but some of them you want to cook all the time because they're really good. So they might have a plus three fishing or a plus three combat. Um, I can't remember. I think it's the miners treat or something that has a plus three combat. It's really handy. Look at our fish collection. We are going well. That's the catfish. But today we are going hunting for where is he? One of these ones. Uh, one of these. There he is. That's what we're after today. We're after the angler. This is very exciting. All right, I need to get on with things. I will be back with you when I have watered all of my crops. Look at this weather. Look how gorgeous it is. With all of the leaves whizzing by. I absolutely love it. Hmm. Now, what are we going to put in? I guess we're going to put some tomatoes in here. Make tomato pickle, or possibly tomato jelly. I'm not sure. Put those away these and sell them right now for our barn we need i hope i've got enough stone 150 stone yes 350 wood and 6,000 gold but of course i forgot nearly forgot darn it we need to clear the area this is uh this is very important i don't want to go all the way up there and then she can't build it so i'm actually going to put it on the same level as the coop so this will have to go and this will have to go it's 
going to look really good though and unfortunately I need to chop all of this grass but um, it's not a waste because as you can see uh, with those little hay things over my head that means that the hay is going into the silo and that is great so we'll just I don't want to clear too much which I think I've already cleared too much but I'm going to leave that gap there and then maybe we should put them even a bit closer yeah let's do that although you know I could put my two mayonnaise machines and my two milk machines there put my barn here all right yep let's do that let's clear just a tiny bit more that should be enough it's actually not that big it looks big but it's not that big okay and before I forget which I nearly did I'm going to get my fishing rod uh, a trap bobber and my trout soup ready to go all right let us go and get ourselves a barn how exciting this is that means cows I love, oh, oh and I swear Nettie I will finish the fence so my chickens don't escape and go wandering around the farm uh, it really is sometimes you feel like you're juggling a million jobs in this game and it's ridiculous that uh, you know you do that in real life and it's like, oh, I hate it, it's so bad. But you do it in the game and it's like, this is so much fun. I don't know why. I don't know. Humans are funny. We are funny, funny people. Robin, Robin, hello. I am here because I want a barn. This is exciting. I'm so glad. Okay, so we whiz over here and we put it, yeah, just there, I think. Is that it? That looks right. Yes. Oh, brilliant. There we go. We bought ourselves a barn. Thank you, Robin. That is fantastic. I'm just going to go and say hello to Mara. Mara, do you like my tiara? All these falling leaves will provide food for mushrooms and other small organisms. That is right. Interesting, isn't it? It is. It is. This is why I love fall. Well, that's our main job done today. And now we are going to go and have a go at getting the legendary fish and this is where we need to go so we've got to go down here uh, down this up here now this one that I'm going for is actually one of the easiest legendary fishes to get so if as long as you have fishing level three you can try for this guy but he only comes out in fall all right I'm gonna eat my trout soup so I can get that plus one fishing. Wish me luck. That was a good cast. Come on. I'm pretty sure it's below the bridge. Maybe it's above the bridge. Well, we'll try both. If we don't get any good uh, hits, we'll try both. Come on. I don't think that's him. No. That's a salmon. All right, let's try north of the bridge. I'm getting some good casts here. Uh, no, I don't think that's him either. <laughs> Come on, we got a happy day. We've got a lucky day. The spirit's very happy today. Yay, a small mouth bass. All right, let's try down again. <sighs> Come on. Come on. Oh, that's him. That's him. See how he's got the little thing over his head? And I am not even going to try for that treasure because this guy is zippy. Come on. Yes, yeah, stay down the bottom. Stay down the bottom. Yes. Oh, my gosh. That was a lot easier than I thought it would be. <laughs> but, I mean, it's very easy to lose him in those first few seconds. Um, if you, like, when he zips right up the top, if you're not right on top of it and ready for it, you can lose him and that is it then you just got to wait again and try again but did you see um on the actual fishing bobber the fish itself had that little lumpy thing coming up the top which i think is supposed to be a gem and that represents if you ever see that that means this is a legendary fish the thing that makes them legendary is you can only ever catch one of them so now that i've caught this angler fish i can't catch any more angler fish he is a very, very special fish. 
and I need to be careful not to accidentally sell him. And what I will do eventually, of course, is get a frame set up in my house and put all of the um, all of the legendary fish there. That was fantastic. Oh, I'm so very pleased with that. I can't even tell you. And I guess now we just fish for the rest of <laughs> I don't know. What else can I get? Um, oh, actually, I'll go to the ocean because I don't think there's anything in the river that I can get on a sunny day that's worth getting because I've got, you know, I've got my plus one fishing. I don't want to waste it. So I'm going to head down to the beach and out to the rock and see if I can get some of the other fish that I am missing. I'm pretty sure that I've finished the ocean fish bundle. Yes, yeah, so I've just got river, night and lake. River, that's a rain fish. Lake, that's in summer. Unfortunately, I'm so bummed that I missed the lake fish. Uh, that's rain and what about the eel? I think he's rain too. Yeah, he is. So both of those are rain fish which is very disappointing. And I suppose I could go to the mines and try for a ghost fish. You know what, let's do that. Let's head up to the mines and try for a ghost fish. Walking around, I'm wasting, wasting time on my fishing. But uh, that was great. It did not take as long as I thought it would take. Very excited. Hello, Abigail, what are you doing, sweetie? She's just sitting there playing her flute, good honor. Good honor. Um, let's see. Perhaps the nitrogen fixation level is affected by nematode secretions. Oh, sorry. I was pondering some data and didn't notice you there. That's all right, Demetrius. You do your thing. You do your thing. Okay. I think it's level 20. If not, we can find out. Is it level 20? Yes. Okay. So this is where we get our ghost fish from. So give me a ghost fish. And there's actually, oops. So in the mines, there are three fish that you can get. There's a ghost fish on level 20. Uh, I think there's an ice something or other on level 40. And then you can fish something up from lava. I think it's a lava eel. Is it a lava eel further down in the mines? So, and they are quite difficult. See, as you can see, because I, when you get a lot of junk like that, it means that you don't have a high enough skill level or you're very close to not having enough high, high enough skill level to catch a particular fish. And the thing about the ghost fish is it's the only fish that you can get in this water. So you do tend to pick up a lot of junk when you're fishing for the ghost fish. So you just have to be patient and keep casting. And uh, with that in mind, I will keep collecting junk <laughs> until I get a hit. So I'll come back when I get a hit. Oh, we got one. We got one. Oh, and we got a treasure too. And I'm going to go for that treasure. Yes, excellent. So he's not a difficult catch, but you do have to hang around a long time. And what did I get? two emeralds i'm not sneezing at that but look at all the junk i got while i was waiting for him to turn up that's brilliant i'm really pleased with that let's head back up to the surface and uh, go straight to the community center and hand in our ghost fish that is excellent now the other fish for the specialty oh where are you going abigail oh you're going down into the um do you have any scarecrows on your farm just the one unfortunately i don't have any rare crows yet abigail um, I didn't have enough money to buy the Spring Dance Rare Crow, which I'm really disappointed about. But I should have enough money to buy. Hello, Seb. I was this close to moping in bed the entire day. Kind of wish I had now. Oh, my gosh. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> you know, I just, there's so much to do. You know, as soon as the sun comes up, I'm like, let's go, baby. Anyway, specialty fish, that's what we want. In you go. So this guy you can't get until you go to the desert and this guy is in an area called the secret woods which you can't access until you have an iron axe so maybe we should prioritize our iron axe i think that would be a good idea and uh, look there's junimos everywhere hello kids how you doing yeah we'll prioritize our axe so we can go into the secret woods and i can show you that area but uh, we're done for the day oh i don't know if i if i check the job board today better check on my way by just in case 
No, nothing there. Time to head home. Well, we had a bad start to the season, but I think we're sort of pulling it back now. We're pulling it back. We're getting into our stride. I guess because I put so much stress on myself about autumn, about autumn. Sorry, it's autumn in Australia. I'm not used to calling it fall. So please forgive me if I slip up and call it fall now and then. Um, because I put so much stress on myself to to go hard in autumn and to get all this stuff done, I think it really, you know, it put me offside. I was sort of out of step. And uh, I've been making all of these mistakes. Now I'm going to put my anglerfish in there so he doesn't get accidentally sold. Uh, and I'm, nope, that's not what I want. And this goes in here. You do need these gems sometimes for some, oh, what was that ring? Did I make the warrior ring? 10 iron bar. Oh, that's right. 25 coal, 10 frozen tears. Okay. I can't do that yet. Um, can't do quality sprinkler till I've got gold bar, but I got something else yesterday. What was it? It was the seed maker. Oh, and again, I need gold. Okay, well, I can't get gold until I do another run in the mines. Oh, look, it even says use an item on this to change what's displayed. Well, pen, good. Maybe if you read that, uh, you wouldn't have accidentally put a whole heap of stuff on the sign that you didn't mean to and we need to make a cheese press when we get our cows but uh, that's for later all right let's put this away and we have some honey lovely lovely honey and you go in here and you go in here these are great you know you get just honey without having to do anything uh, and the best thing about it is can I make another beehive? How do I make it? Oh, it's eight coal. 40 wood, eight coal, iron bar, maple syrup. All right, I might start saving up my maple syrup. Actually, I've just remembered, okay, I need to plant another maple tree in that place where I accidentally dug one out, but I can put two tappers in. So that is really good. I'll make two more tappers and I will plant another maple tree. So tappers, what's tappers? Where are they? There they are. 40 wood, two copper bar. Oh, I might not have might not have enough wood since. Oh, I do. That's fine. Since we just bought our barn. That's so exciting. I cannot tell you how excited I am about that. One, two. Beautiful. So let's go plant our maple seed down here. Two. Beautiful. And you get a tapper and you get a tapper and what i need to remember to do because this is going to be my tapper area from now on uh, what i need to remember to do when these tappers sort of produce something is to take them off the trees so i can move them down to the other trees but i'll have to wait and when did i last check my mushrooms i don't know i'm running around like a maniac that's not your mushrooms pen oh but look at that over there mushrooms all boring mushrooms but never mind they're still mushrooms look at this over here my pomegranate tree has grown only missed one day so hopefully hopefully that won't that will mean that i can still get a pomegranate before the end of the season if i can't then i'm in trouble all right let's put that wood away let's put that copper away put some more things like glasses in my recycling machine this is the best way to get quartz you can also get refined quartz by cooking plain quartz but uh, honestly that uses a coal so it's cheaper just to put things in your recycling machine hello joe wow look how crowded my house is i really need to look at getting that house upgrade so a i can get a kitchen and b i can spread out a bit more all right let's hop into bed and see how our da did i wait did i lock my chicken coop did i no i didn't oh that was a good catch pen that was a good catch lock that you know it would be great pressure plates in front of the gate so you didn't have to stop and open them every time you went through never mind let's get into bed and see how our day went yes i know it's one o'clock i'm going to bed right now day six there we go two thousand 
173 gold from farming. That is brilliant. And this is like the cheap stuff. This is hardly anything and we are raking in the gold, which is great because we spent 6,000 gold today on a barn. But never mind, that will all start to pay off soon. Well, my friends, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please consider dropping me a like. And if this is your first time, please consider subscribing for more Stardew Valley content, Minecraft content and Minecraft tutorials. Tomorrow is the last day of week one of fall. Let's make it a good one. Thank you very much for watching, my friends, and I will see you tomorrow for another day in Stardew Valley.